Today, the Lord speaks as follows. Listen closely. From the annals of time, of the ages gone by, Adam foretold of deception of old. He spoke of knowledge and wonders to behold, to let his sons know of the dangers to behold. He turned to look at the tree of old, only to see his soul was sold. Deceived by the beast from old, the serpent that glistened and told the woman of old, You shall not die, but behold the knowledge of old. Creation was set for a time to behold the reign of kings that earth would hold. Marvel not at the light you see, for it's the worship that I seek. See how I was placed in the garden with thee, in the garden in the east? Look around to the other trees. There's not one that please. And the words of knowledge to accompany are, The annals of history are now written. The time spoken about is now underway. The trial of the ages underway. Here I come with vengeance of heart. None shall escape, says the Lord. The year of the kings have been seated. Now here is the mind of wisdom. The seven heads are seven hills on which the woman is seated. They are also seven kings. The seven thunders declare the seven seats. The expanse of time, the decretion of time. The curse of old released in the time foretold. Here it comes, sevenfold. Seven countries, seven nations, my father's anger, my father foretold. Seven diadems are seated. Now shall I strengthen them to shine. So I shall polish them and put the broadsword in their hands, says the Lord. Seven diadems, seven treasures, seven seats, seven kings, seven eyes, seven powers. Seven kings from the east, says the Lord. Let the royal decree come forth. Let a decree be issued throughout all the provinces, says the Lord. Bring forth the royal decree, says the Lord. The proclamation decreed from ages of old, foretold from the prophets of old. The signs below are in the hand foretold, teaching that for buying and selling you must have sold. Let the time begin, says the Lord. A new time begins, a time of trouble, a time of trouble and hardship such as never was since man. Get ready for a shift in the heavenlies, says the Lord. Here come the plagues, says the Lord. Behold the plagues of Egypt I send upon you, O mother of harlots. You have been judged by God. Behold the days of Moses, the plagues of Egypt, says the Lord. Behold the plagues of Egypt, O lady of nations. I smite the land with blight, says the Lord. Pollute the waters, my plagues again. Is this not the God of the earth? Behold, I strike it down. Collapse of the gold market says the Lord. O earth, move out of your place, reel to and fro, says the Lord. I shake and I shake. I shake again. I shake the earth, says the Lord. What's about to happen is huge. So huge, the earth shakes. The continents begin to shift and break apart. After the continental shifts, a remapping takes place and a renaming of the continents. The sun will begin to withdraw its light and the moon will hesitate to run her course. The laws of nature will be interrupted. Lights will be visible at night. Darkness 
will overcast day. Next, Jessica Avery. My father teaches wisdom and instructs in the way of righteousness. Why seek out wisdom of the world? What are you searching for, says the Lord? You are trusting in riches, says the Lord. Jessica, the Lord speaks three things. Here they are. Judgment is coming. Your soul will be weighed in the balance. To which direction will the balance lean? For or against life? Next, Jordan. The Lord says you are serving in quietness. Now you shall be brought into the light of the others, says the Lord. Feed them, says the Lord. Next, Jessica Belinsky. My father sees all things. Does he not know what you need? Why do you doubt, O ye of little faith? You shall see, you shall behold, says the Lord your God. 